Chads, episode 11. Good morning, ladies and gents. My name's Jason from the Two Bruffs Fishing YouTube channel. Are you ready for a battle of the Shads? This is a very important episode, I'll tell you why. Because the Berkeley, the swimming Shad, has won three battles of the Shads in a row. So one more win, and it will go up in the Two Bruffs Fishing Hall of Fame. The battle of the Shads, a perch is two points, a Xander above 50 centimetres is two points, a Xander under 50 centimetres is one point, and a strike is half a point. It has to be on film. So if I do get a strike and it's not on film, it don't count. The Power Bake Swimming Shop in Berkeley is currently number one with 23 points. As for the Mr. Greedy from uh, Lucky John, it's in last place with only 14.5 points. As always, I'll be targeting Xander and Perch. Let's start fishing. Well, both years are flavoured and scented, but but none of them glow in the dark. But but I think the point should go to the Lucky John because it's it's really UV active. The Berkeleys are kind of UV active, but not as much as the Lucky John. So well done, Lucky John. One point for UV scented. Fishing out for an hour with uh, the fluky, the Lucky John, Mr. Greedy. So I'm going to switch now to the current champion, the swimming shad, power bait swimming shad from Berkeley. It's small. The Ozander. Let go of the Berkeley Year. The Ozander. One point for the Berkeley year. Well done, Berkeley. Going for the release. Off he goes. Bye-bye. Price, well. The power bait swimming shop in Berkeley. One pack costs six euros 95 cents per pack. And there's eight years in each pack. So that's about 86 cents per year. Now, as for the Mr. Greedy, Mr. Greedy from uh, Fluky John, from Lucky John, one pack costs six euros and there's seven years in each pack. So that makes it 85 cents per year. So just one cent less than the Berkeley. So yeah, the point for price does go to the Lucky John. 
because it's cheaper. Well done, Lucky John. Fish on. And I think it's decent. It's a Xander, 100% sure. Yeah. Get in. No, not worth measuring. It's not 50. But a decent one. What the fuck did you do? Berkeley year. Look at that. Nice hander. Don't know if you can see it. Right. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna go. Off you go, mate. Gone. Oh, there he is. Five minute break. So at the moment, I've only caught two Xander on the Berkeley year. point for swimming action goes to the power bait swimming shad. It has a supple body with a large paddle tail. It has also a lively and challenging swimming action and this increases your chances of, of a reaction. Well done Berkeley, well done. I got snagged a couple of times on the Mr. Greedy and look I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of ripped in the middle. Um, and I'm using a jig head with a keeper, but it's, see, I don't know, wait, see, it's ripped in the middle. 
and that's just on two snags so i will have to take that into account when doing quality of the plastic actually i'll do let's do quality of the plastic i reckon that the, qual the quality of the plastic of the lucky john the mr greedy is is average is average i got snagged twice yeah twice in a row and it did get ripped in the middle the plastic gear did get ripped in the middle but as for the Berkeley, the power bait uh, swimming shad from Berkeley, I can tell you this, that it's made out of extremely strong plastic, extremely strong. So I think it's only fair that the point for quality of the plastic goes to the power bait swimming shad. Well done Berkeley, one extra point for quality of the plastic. Job well done. Packaging. We'll start with the Berkeley, the power bait swimming shed. That's how the pack looks like. Uh, all the information behind is in French and in English, as mentioned in previous Battle of the Shads. All kinds of drawings here yellow, white, red. There's a bit of green here. Don't know if that makes a difference or not, but, anyways, that's how the pack looks like. As for the Mr. Greedy, it's much more it's much more compact, uh, strong plastic. The information is in English: black, red, yellow, white. Uh, the information behind is in Russian, Estonian. I don't know what that is. What is LV? And in English. So I think the point for packaging should go to the Lucky John. It's much more compact, it's a bit classier I think. But anyways, yeah, one point for packaging to the Lucky John. Well done. Fish on, it's Xander, 100% short. Oh, and it's a decent one. Oh yeah, I think it might be over 50. It's not ready yet. Yep, got it. I was lucky. Look at that. Fucking hell. It might be over 50, you know. I'll have to measure it. Yep. 53. Oh my god! 53. A Xander above 50 centimeters is worth two points. So two extra points for the power bait swimming shad from Berkeley. Well done, well done. I'm gonna check for damage now. See you in a bit. Look at that. No damage to the lure. No damage. Size and color. Well, the power bait swimming shad from Berkeley comes in four different sizes and in 20 different colors. As for the Lucky John, the Mr. Greedy, it comes in only three different sizes and in 15 different colours. So yeah, you've guessed it right. The point for size and colour goes to Berkeley. 
Well done, Berkeley. Well done. Four sizes, 20 different colors. Lovely jubbly. And still, heavyweight champion of the world. The power beige from Berkeley. It scored one, two, three, four, five, seven points altogether. It got a point for size and color, a point for swimming action, a point for quality of the plastic, a point for Xander, a point for Xander, and two points for Xander above 50 centimeters. Great stuff, great stuff. Well done, Berkeley. Well done, Berkeley. Four wins in a row. Four wins in a row. You know what that means? We've got another Hall of Famer. The power bait, swimming shad from Berkeley goes up in the Two Bruffs Fishing Hall of Fame. Well done, Berkeley. Welcome to the Two Bruffs Fishing Hall of Fame. Four wins in a row, bloody hell. Well done, well done. Cheers for watching, and I'll be back very soon with another video. Yes, yes. Let's go. Well done. Both years. Oh, the fucking lorry. Bloody hell. Your chances of of a reaction between and well done. Fucking background noise, fucking hell. <laughs>